Happy Friday. I'm Miss Black Gold and I have a, another Dollar Tree haul for you. So I went by this morning because there were some items that we just did not have that um, we needed. And you know when you run into the Dollar Tree for one thing, you see other things and it's all over. But by TJ Farm Select, I picked up sliced peaches. I picked up a berry banana blend and I also picked up some strawberries. The peaches are 12 ounces. And this frozen fruit, guys, it's actually a lot less to buy this fruit from the Dollar Tree than it is to go at your grocery store when it's frozen. Um, but the berry banana blend is 10 ounces. And the strawberries are 10 ounces. And all this fruit does have um, dates on it. This has a date of... It says September 2nd, 2022. You can see it down there on the bottom of the bag. The banana berry blend says April 4th, 2022. And it's two dates, so I'm not sure if it's the date it was packaged, April 4th, 2020, and then the date that you should use it by. And then last, the peaches have two dates on them, but the use-by date is... Um, April 4th, 2022, down here on the bottom. And the last product that is frozen fruit is by Jennifer's Garden, which are their mango chunks. And this is a 10 ounce bag. And this does have a best before date of January 10th, 2022 on the back. And there go the mango chunks. Then there's Jennifer's Garden, traditional vegetable spring rolls. Love these. These do not stay in a Dollar Tree. And you guys, 10 of these, you can't even buy two spring rolls for no less than probably $2 from the Chinese carryout. So pick those Jennifer Garden up. Do those have a date on the back of them, guys? But I picked those up. We love those in this house. Put those in the air fryer. Put those in the oven. They are delicious. Let me see. Real quick, let me. Oh, yeah. And there is a best before date on these of March 22nd. 2022. I grabbed three packs of these because I'm telling you, you, when you want them, they're gone. Another item that does not stay in the Dollar Tree because mozzarella sticks are expensive in the grocery store. The farm rich mozzarella sticks, oh my goodness. Every time I want to go in there and get them, they're never on sale and they cost an arm and a leg. So picked up three boxes of these Snaps mozzarella sticks. This is just a five ounce box, but these are so good. You have to be really careful when you're cooking these. Heat up not too high because that cheese will pop out of these quickly. But best buy date on these are October 8th, 2021. Again, the Snaps mozzarella sticks. Love those. Are there any other Snaps products you like? I see the jalapeno poppers and um, the baked potato skins or something. This is called Donut Time. These are the naturally flavored glazed donuts. Nine ounces. It says, wow, six donuts for a dollar trying to see if I see a date on these. It says a product of Canada, because I have never seen these here. Um, yeah, I don't really per se see a date, I see that. But frozen product, and it does say, once you thaw these out, it says keep frozen until you're ready to use, thaw at room temperature, maybe one to two hours, and enjoy within five days after you have thawed. So I'm gonna put these in the freezer for the moment, and I guess if uh, my sons want them, We'll take them out and let those thaw out. I am always looking for this in the Dollar Tree. I usually will always see coconut and canola, but not the butter flavored all the time. So this is the Healthy Chef Butter Flavored No Stick Cooking Spray. It is a five ounce can. It says for fat free cooking. I enjoy all of these from the Dollar Tree, whether it is those other brand, other types of uh, cooking spray that I just named. We are, we are a muffin eating family. So I did grab this, the Betty Crocker Chocolate Chip Muffin Mix. Um, I have not made myself chocolate chip muffins in a while. Um, matter of fact, today I am making banana blueberry muffins. Uh, but this makes just about six muffins. This is a 6.5 ounce bag from Betty Crocker. And it's a best if used by date on here of June 17th, 2021. Very faint, but you can see that. And I know my middle one loves Avery. He loves chocolate chip muffins. Actually, chocolate chip muffins are a favorite of mine, too. And you all, who 
If you like chocolate chip muffins, when you have to buy them, who do you think has the best chocolate chip muffins? I'm going to tell you, hands down for me, and I've mentioned this, I think, in a video a long time ago, Whole Foods chocolate chip muffins, and in particular, there's this one Whole Foods in Maryland, in Rockville, Maryland, I think somewhere off of Executive Boulevard. Their chocolate chip muffins, they put this crumb topping on top of it. Oh my gosh, they are so good. Because I've tried other Whole Foods chocolate chip muffins and they aren't the same as that location. Goya chickpeas, 15.5 ounce. And I have a good friend of mine who is, you know, she's done with the whole Goya company right now. <laughs> You know, dealing with Trump, whatever. So, she's just done with them. And if she knew I picked this up today, oh, she would read me one. She really would. But I love my chickpeas. And the Dollar Tree had them. And they were right there. And I grabbed them. I know. I'm going to have to start making my way to the international market. So, I can actually start picking up a lot of stuff that I can't get from the Dollar Tree. Pigeon peas, Malby bark. I got to get to the um, international market. So, this baking soda is 16 ounces. The company is called, and I just saw it on a sign. Now this says distributed by um, Greenbrier, but there was a company name for this baking soda on the shelf. And this was just 59 cents at the Dollar Tree. They had this on sale for 59 cents, not a dollar. And this says Best Buy, March 5th, 2023. Supreme Tradition Chop Chives, 0.35 ounces. And I just thought this, I do not have this as a herb. I don't have this in my pantry and I needed this. What I would love to see at the Dollar Tree is some dry thyme. Can you get me some dry thyme at the Dollar Tree? Um, I see the parsley, the oregano, the Italian seasoning, the chives, but I never see, I see basil too, but I never see thyme. I would love some dry thyme leaves. Husky 0.7 milliliter plastic drop cloths. They are nine feet by 12 feet. And I grabbed two of these, made in the USA, which is well, I meant to tell you all, this baking soda is made in the USA too. Um, but don't know what I'm gonna be using these for, but I just went ahead and grabbed them, you never know. Could even use them for when we're painting at home, which is why I went ahead and picked up Rich Art Acryology, which is premium acrylic paint. And this is in deep green and deep yellow. They are both what said made in the USA four fluid ounces aren't you loving loving the art sections at the Dollar Tree now they are so specific and just they have everything now it's an art like a, a person who loves arts and crafts it is a arts and craft dream now at the Dollar Tree this is the Bolero concentrated times two gentle body wash and just peachy no parabens no dyes 10 fluid ounces. Let me get a whiff. Oh, it's sealed. But you can still smell some. It smells really peachy. It smells nice. Because um, I'm enjoying the pineapple. My boys haven't even tried the watermelon that's in their bathroom yet. But I'm loving the pineapple. And it has the little beads on the inside. So I picked up the Just Peachy. I wanted to try this. Aren't these the cutest signs? Wi-Fi, sweet Wi-Fi. Password is... Then you got the hashtag, and you can put it in chalk, the password right there. This is so cute. So I'm definitely going to do that, and we'll hang that hopefully somewhere right here in a little, you know, common area. But I thought this was so cute. They have two other different signs that uh, are just like this, and you can write the Wi-Fi password on it, but they say different things. So they do have a new line. I can't remember what the other flavors were, you guys. Or scent, excuse me, I can't remember the other scents were. But this is Bolero, oh, Banana, Banana was one, Banana Blast. And then there was something else, like a blueberry or something. But this is a Jelly Eye Cream Fresh Avocado. Um, out of the Fresh Avocado line, this was all that I picked up. I'm always down for a good eye cream. I do notice, you know, under here, so I'm always down for a great eye cream. This is just 0.5 fluid ounces. It says the Jelly Eye Cream Fresh Avocado is a calming and refreshing formula that boosts your skin's natural glow. And I love avocados. It always amazes me when somebody says they don't like avocado. Um, and I know a couple people that don't. How about you, do you like avocado? This is the Biore Free Your Pores Charcoal Great for Oily Skin Cleansing Micellar Water. No need to rinse, it is oil free. 
and it says all in one and that oily skin caught me because I do have oily skin matter of fact look I did I swear you guys I just use a allure witch hazel cleansing wipe to wipe my face and I feel like my forehead is still shining um, and then my baby had the nerve to be like mommy did you wash your face when I was getting ready to do my video and I was like yeah I did I washed my face this morning I said, what, my, my skin is shining, look oily? He said, yeah. <laughs> it's just, it comes with the territory. But you guys, this is 2.5 fluid ounce. And then really stoked to find these hard candy eyeshadow palettes. They are beautiful. They are so gorgeous. Like that gold and then that orange there. The shimmering, I, they are just, this is gorgeous. This is really beautiful palette. A really beautiful palette that won't end up on my face. But it is so gorgeous. I'll give it to my daughter, see if she likes it. And they actually, on the back, have the name of everything. How cute is that? Purple Haze. Oh, that orange is called Blossom. And then the gold is Sun Kiss. That's Sun Kiss right there. But this is just gorgeous. It comes with two. Oh, look, and the, the eyeshadow brushes have brushes on both ends, I think. Or does it come with four? But this is their Look Pro eyeshadow palette. It is titled Earthy Vixen, item number 1444. Show you the back again so you can see all of that. But just beautiful. And then I picked up two toys that I want to take with me when I go. Um, so we're, we're trying, fingers crossed. I hope everything works out. Um, we are going to visit my sis in Idaho in August. And... I'm hoping things work out because in Idaho, their corona rate is going up right now where when this pandemic first started and everybody else was, you know, going up in numbers, um, they weren't. But now it is. I'm just hoping nothing changes where we won't be allowed to go visit. But that being said, for my little niece, I have cool things. Collect them all. One doll inside. It says find the special rainbow doll, which wouldn't that be cute? But either one, I just thought that was cute. They have a bunch of different ones on the back. And it tells you which unicorn doll. This was the last little unicorn doll. I didn't even see a box in there. So that's a little grab bag, they call it. And then this is the Polly Pocket Lila. Age, this is for ages four plus. Oh yeah, this little one says ages three plus, the unicorn doll. Um, but this Polly Pocket is a Mattel toy. And I grabbed that for my, my niece. Starlink Battle for Atlas. Another one of those toys. Ages 8 plus. These are the weapons that can go with the ship. And this is Shockwave and Gauss Gun. And this is a Ubisoft product. Freeman Anti-Stress Sea Salt Mud Face Mask and 1.5 fluid ounces. I never had this one. I had the pomegranate, the cucumber, the grapefruit. But had never had this one. And I like the Freeman products. Now this is a mud face mask because I think the other three I had um, were peel off. Yeah, that grapefruit, the cucumber, and I think it's a charcoal one. I can't remember y'all, but the other ones that came in containers that looked like this, I believe most of those were peel off. So I just saw this one, I picked that up. Freeman Beauty Infusion Brightening Overnight Mask with hibiscus and vitamin C. I love hibiscus. Y'all know what hibiscus, the hibiscus flower is good for too? That's what we call sorrel when we drink sorrel. Let me, I'm trying to take this thing out of here so you can see what it looks like. Okay, so you put this on your face and you must have to leave it on. A serum infused facial mask. That's what it looks like in the box. So that's what we paid a dollar for. It better work, right? It better, it better brighten. A plaster clean face and neck, avoid contact with eyes. It absorbs into the skin and there's no need to worry about getting it on your pillow. Use two times a week or as often as needed. Okay, so maybe this is more just like something you put on. I wonder how much, how long this little bit will last. If you can use it twice a week. But we shall see, right? We shall see. Thank you guys for watching my Dollar Tree haul. The weekend is here. We made it. We made it. Monday through Friday, we got through it. Y'all stay blessed. Have an awesome weekend on Thursday.